Hello! It is me, and the Blages. Ooh, am I wonky? Yeah, everything's wonky. Hang on. Hmm. Cable must have got tugged. Hello! I have returned. We have returned from Finland, Finland, Finland. Ah. Oh. The place I want to be. Had a bloody wonderful time. Truly excellent. Uh, and we've... And I'm very excited uh, to talk about it. And also just to be back in general and stuff like that. Okay, capture a specific window, cassette piece. I mean, you're still wonky, just not tilted anymore. <laughs> ah. You happy? <laughs> you're happy there's a punny DLC? Yes, yes I am. I mean, it's peer of the unknown, not peer into the unknown. That would, yeah, that would be even more so. Uh, but yes, I'm, I'm very excited about the, the Delk. I'm very excited to be playing the Delk of this game that I like a whole lot. Ah, so if I line it up here, brilliant. Oh, fear of the unknown. Ah, oh, that does make sense. I'm not Goomba. What's a Goomba? Look at this Goomba. This Goomba. <laughs> Very excited. My throat, my voice is still a little bit hoarse. All right, what have I been doing since we last saw our uh, beasts of the cassettes? Well, I have um, maxed out relationships with. Everybody, I've got a whole bunch of these uh, bootlegs. I think I have seven. One of which has the same element as another one. Winnie, <laughs> horse, you say? Uh, and the bootlegs spit out powerful uh, tapes on the reg. I have played more in order to uh, do some of this stuff, but I have not gone to the Pier of the Unknown. Oh, now I say it. It does. I see. I see the sound. Now I say it. Do we need to rest? We do not. Wonderful. We go south. Into the unknown. Rowing boat. Into the unknown. Ah. Victory in the deadlands. Just trying to keep an eye out. Let's see if I get any rogues. No! I don't want to fight a crab! Hello? You were disassociating, it sounded like. Town Beach, where it all began, where I washed up. So many days of gameplay ago. So many traversal powers. Boat. You know, I've always had the ships with occasionally wash up on the shore, but never one piece. Just like in my animes. Get in the rowing boat! Get in the boat! Get in the boat! Get in the boat! The boat begins to move by itself. Oh my god, is it haunted or is it correct? So this is where the rowboat was taking us. Not that I know where this is, of course. I, I don't think anyone has sailed too far from the coast of New World. Yeah, it's a world of danger, so I guess it makes sense. Oh, it's handy. What if I go the direction it was pointing? I'd probably die. Yeah. 
mean, it's not death, it's just continuing. Right side pier. I guess we have a name for this place, at least. Let me just... I think I've turned the volume way down on this so I can play in the background of other stuff. Yes, yes I have. How is volume for people at home? Right side here. Ah, the witch house. Uh, the witch house is the name of that um, band, I believe, that uh, Meredith wanted. Uh, Don't think Mr. Brightside would fit the mood of this place, but Brain sponsors the music, so. Do they know there are no seats here? Are there meant to be chairs? Um, are you, um, uh, standing comfortably? <laughs> Good! Then let us begin the show! I welcome you all. The time grows near. To Brightside Pier. I, am I heard about it before, but I love that there's a Gwen. I am Gwen, humble host and ring mistress of the Brightside Pier. You have received a special invitation to its grand opening, reopening of this once-in-a-lifetime carnival of entertainment. Or at least that's what I would be saying if this place was ready for the public. Unfortunately, I'm having some technical difficulties. Well. It appears three main attractions are each powered by rusty old machines that keep them running day and night. Something has happened to these infernal engines, and now their instability threatens the safety of the entire pier. This happened on my watch. Because of the nasty blighters that have since moved in, I'm unable to fix them myself. I set out that boat to your island in hopes that someone would come help me resolve my, uh, slight predicament. <laughs> um, with you so far? You can help out? Well? What do you think? Do you think you'd be able to give these infernal engines a good old wallop and get them working again? Fantastic. Sure. I knew from the moment I saw you, you'd be up to the task. Around the pier, you'll be able to find prize tickets. That's right, we have a new currency now for people who've played the old game too much. If you connect enough of these, I'll exchange them for a pass to let you into an attraction. You have all the attraction passes already. I am duty bound as both a host and a clown to abide by the rules of the establishment. Besides, it's more fun this way. Go on, let me do it. Come on, come on. Peer of the unknown. Disable the three internal en infernal engines of right side pier. Mm. About you. You're asking about me. I'm just little old Gwen. I may be the custodian of the pier, but more than anything, I'm here to learn how to create. I spent a lot of my early life watching people create things, stories, experiences. The very act of making something from nothing that brings people joy has always fascinated me. I hope that answers your question. She wants to be an artist. I could probably tell from the get up. Okay, so we have a campground. We have some little glitchy lights going beep to beep. I think those are chests. Oh. Can I get on one of these? Oh. Okay. That opens a box. Because. Hi, Gwen! Yes! Prize ticket. Jump scare! Pulp and Ice 9. Wonderful. I have far better versions of uh, Jump Scare, but hey, I will, I will happily take the other stuff. 
Does that mean I cannot get on the horses? I had to interact with the horses. Oh, okay. The witch house requires a green ticket. Oh, a button. I found another button! Hooray. Prize tickets. Prize tickets! Alright, this is going pretty well so far. What's this tiny box? Hmm. Curious. Oh, okay! More island. That's also pretty cool. That'll create a whirlwind, allow me to get back. Yeah. Prize ticket! Ticket in exchange for a ride that passes at the right side pier. The paper feels crisp and delicate, like dead leaves. Plus some materials and an aerosol tape. Oh, you have to keep it. You have to press it when you want to go. Okay. For the sake of symmetry, because this map does look relatively symmetrical, is there a button over here? No, that needs a red ticket. Not enough. But that's a freaking blinking. Oh no, it's just the side of the witch house. Okay. I made it! Cosmic zone. Okay, so we found a cube. Going around here allows us to rotate. Why? What? Balls. Or is it trying to communicate to me so that I should use the electricity? Hmm. Alright, well we got a we got a cube, that's something. This little arrow. Well, that didn't work. Well, that's fine. Anyway, we got some tickets. Gwen, hello, Gwen. So they require four. Great, I got four. Green, pink, or red. I feel like I'll go for pink last because I like pink the most. Green. And what is this way on this part of the map? Hmm, 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 hmm. Magic crab! Ah, Cass, the Merlin is waiting for you. Please come, come with me to platform A of Harper Town. Uh, wait, are you forcibly making me leave? Oh, sorry, we're just gonna hang out. Uh, the Merlin will now speak through me. Really? Interesting. Cass, the Merlin wishes to thank you for your part in defeating their wayward st student, Aleph. Humankind is about to face the challenge of unprecedented proportions. The outcome is not yet certain. I love this the sound of a train. The Merlin was curious to see if your species' warlike nature could be overcome. But by defeating Aleph, manifestation of conquest... You have performed your role in the ritual. You are now free to leave. We had help from Morgante. Ah, uh, yes. Morgante, Aleph's old lover. What? What? Rebellion and conquest weren't always enemies. Well, that does make sense. What is the spirit of rebellion without the four of all four several to rebel against? What is the king of conquest without someone to, to, to conquer? The Rude King and the White Queen, trapped in a constant cycle, death and rebirth, opposition and unity, Cool Ranch and Nacho Cheese. They are the engine that turns the wheel of human history. 
They even have a son once. Did you know that? No! I didn't fucking know that! What the fuck? Morgante's m manifestation during your battle with Aleph doesn't minimize the part you played in defeating him. Quite the opposite, in fact. It was your will that invoked her, and thereby cut short Aleph's return to the wider cosmos. Okay, so I think what's happening, this isn't Peer of the Unknown. This is that I did a bunch of, like, post-game quests, and it became the thing that the Merline is sentient. So I believe I'm getting the post story. Speak your ma ma mind, Cass. The Merline knows you have a request. You need to start the rogue fusions. They're fucking everywhere and they're fucking people up. The Merline could stop the rogue fusions. However, it would not be right to deprive others of the same opportunities you've had, Cass. Your kind must face life and death situations in order to grow in more than just number. It is long past time you return to your own worlds, Cass and Felix. It is there that you and the spirit of rebellion are needed. Oh, Cass! Ah. Uh, what are we doing? The last few minutes seem to have slipped my mind. The uh, Merlin was talking through you? You count yourself very fortunate, Cass. They don't descend to this plane often. Mm. Do you think they're telling the truth about the world's needing us? Here comes the sun. Report back to Ianthi. Come face to face with a faceless being. Achievement unlocked. I see something over there. That's a box. Fused material. Sure fire. Uncommon. It dees. Dees nuts. One day there'll be a secret by going through one of these tunnels. One day. Okay, so that that quest is um. That quest is fun and all, I'm sure. But uh. I, I actually came here to do the DLC quest. Ooh, a chest. Is that not a chest? Is this a chest that I've opened? How can it be a chest that I've opened? Oh, there's the... No! No, 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 Uh, I'm gonna die, I lose a bunch of materials. I'm not level 100 yet. I mean, I'm pretty close. Preempt. Oh. Yeah, I've done some cool stuff. Uh, now when I do a critical hit and that attack has a high chance of critical, uh, the Rip Terror, my lightning Rip Terror, will recharge all of its AP. It's pretty crazy. Because I got a the, I got the opportunity to buy critical AP uh, at rare at rare, which gives it plus one slot. So I just bought loads of them, and it allows you to have basically an infinite number of that. So that's that's wild. Mind meld, mind meld. Deja vu. up. Oh, it would happen twice if I had uh, more AP. Creative Endeavor. Ow! Rude. Do I 
right, so I'm kind of trapped in this fight. Heal. I definitely prefer if Morgante wasn't healing regularly from this, but alright. A glatter beat down cannot be evaded. Not the music. Oh shit! I forgot, one of the things this fight is that you have to have shields up for Coda Morgana, otherwise you take like over a million damage and you immediately die. In fairness, I didn't want to be here! God, that's a lot of wheat. I was dragged here by Magic Crab at a plot quest I wasn't on. Right, well that was something. Hello, rumor people. Rude of it to suck you in when you want to be that role. I know, right? Oh, 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 oh. Uh, a ranger cache mustering to itself. That is a uh, Ms. Mimic. I need to catch one of those. I have not caught one. And I only have like four critters left to catch from the original content. To the woods! Hello, Mary Crab. I'm not talking to you right now because you did us dirty. Sorry, Magic Crab. And we're all rested and good? Yeah, we rested at the doctors after we died. Fun times, fun times for all. There it is! I would think. So I don't want to do too much damage right away. Swap tape. Oh, don't you just look delicious! Said the box. I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, put in the cash. Oh, put in the cash. Ms. Mimic. Femme Fatale. Wow, she has a kick-ass to preemptive strike. She's got spikes for boobs. That's pretty cool. Deja vu. I have been in. I have not been in this place before. Okay, so she got a good amount of health. Got a good amount of time to try and catch her. She's a bit of a badass, I must say. Item. Uh, blank tapes. I want a metal tape. Ferrochrome. That's a very low chance. Corroded. Multi strike. Ow. Ow, that's a lot of damage, actually. Recording failed. Wild balls. Okay, switch back to Larry, the cable guy. Yeah, 
Yeah, Larry shouldn't kill her right away. Multi strike, multi strike. Eight stacks of multi strike. Jesus! That's a lot of damage! Fucking hell. So who have the art fins was there? Oh, yes! Yes, the art fins! Oh my god, it was so good. Oh, it's such a wonderful time. Uh, let's go for a chrome type. So our hosts were Hope, Sara, and Paiyu. Uh, okay, Casa de Ultimate Dragon says Hope in his uh, hilarious post about it. 41! Higher! No! Missed. Wonderful. Ugh! Cool! Ms. Mimics can replicate the appearance of objects of great value. Now on New World, they have taken on resembling item caches left across the island by rangers. Oh. I was expecting a ranger, expecting some valuable supplies, but instead, find Miss Mimics barbed claws. Yay! Good job. Thank you. Gwen had to fight this thing many times in order to get that. It's a rare drop as well. Bite! Hooray! Okay, map. Can I go to the pier? Oh, I can travel to Brightside Pier. Ah! It's not on the map. But you can get to it from the map. Okay, that's cool. Rest! Rest immediately! Oh, Jesus. Hmm. <laughs> I guess so. The way this place has slightly like, slowly decay has so much character. Every patch of rust every patch of rust tells a story. I guess I could also be overthinking it. Possible. So yes, we had a wonderful time there. Um, Asada was wonderful, making tea for us re very regularly because she knows we're complete stereotypes of England. Uh, Deviant Nails, hello! Lurk, 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 lurk. Thank you, hello, welcome to the stram. How's it going? Hope you're doing alright. Let's swap to take the fancy trash. Yeah, Finland was... Magical. Is this something? This feels like it should be something. No. Okay, cool. Oh, I figure I know what this is. Press ticket. There we go. Well, that was surprisingly easy. How about this? I think we're going up here. It would appear not! Cool, okay. Oh, let's talk about... Yeah, they have a, a, a sauna in their, in their basement. Well, their basement's been converted into a sauna, which is super cool. Oh, that's an electric button. Oh, that's what I need the, um, the box for. The box is... Hello? But there appears to be an umbrella that's alive. I mean, I've seen enough Resident Evil to know that's concerning. You box, get over here. I am Magneto. Master of magnetism. Give me the things. Badoop. Well, that didn't work, did it? The chest. And... Price ticket. Okay. What about this thing? I need a key. Oh, there's gotta be some new cassette pieces in here with some new puns and I wanna see them! Uh, yeah, the basement had been converted into a sauna, which was delightful. Uh, it meant that there were some days where we could just, you know, uh, get back and have a sauna. 
Uh, which made it very easy to get to sleep. Loved it. More prize tickets. Yes. Which ticket did I get first? I think I got red, right? Green. Sorry, so green is the witch house. <coughs> I fear I'm starting off too strong. Ooh, is it a big elevator? That the wallpaper's on a roller. Oh, no, it feels like an elevator. Cool. Cool trick of the walls here. I wonder how it works. The walls have noise. Oh, the light's about to go out. Suspicious. Pawn dance! Pawn dance. Quite high level pawn deads as well, Jesus. Oh, but not high level enough. <sighs> ah. Yeah, I, ooh, the paintings in the background melted. That's cool. Uh, yeah, brain, 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 brain. I talked about it a bit on the Instagram stories, but yeah, it was amazing. We, uh,. We arrived at Helsinki Airport and there was a Tom of Finland exhibition on at the museum that was meters away from when we got in from the airport and also really close to the um, the train uh, that we were going to take to uh, Turku. Uh, it was a two hour train, it was a double decker train! I have never seen such a thing in my life, that is amazing! I'm very happy, because I'm several stereotypes all rolled into one, apparently. The ink stain on the carpet gives me pause. Pause. Oh, this one. Oh, an angel statue! That's concerning. Hello? What are you? You're a new guy! Oh, what are you? Oh, lit Littler Red. Like an even smaller Red Riding Hood? Is it gonna litter? Oh, I'm so excited to something new. Zoomies! Deja vu! Flames! Flames! The side of my face! So we went to a Tom of Finland uh, thing. It was amazing. Uh, we went to... What? 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 Smack. Again, smack. It's gonna critique lit literature. <laughs> Oh, it's a uh, literature, literature. Oh, it's sparkly now. Glitter's an amazing effect. Tape it, tape it, tape it, tape it. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yes. Oh, very high. Brilliant. This should fuck it up. Mmm, and fuck it up it did. This earlier. Hundo P. Red. Little red. 
in their immature states have the potential to maintain their civil and friendly personas into adulthood, or give in to their inner beasts. What would drive such a courteous creature to such bloodlust? Oh, I've got to get one of these in my party. I've got to see what it becomes. And then it dies. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we took a double decker train from Helsinki to Turku, which was amazing. Just a very pretty train. Oh. It was mushroom season. So you saw, so we got to see a lot of people. Um, we got to see some people in uh, Turku, the main thoroughfare, with crates, with boxes of mushrooms that they'd picked. Uh, selling them, which is super cool. Charlequin. Charlie Quinn. Oh, it's a charlatan and a harlequin. Awesome. Mushrooms! Yeah! Also, a fucking banshee! I... I spent so many few pieces getting banshee. It's irritating, but okay. Ooh, nearly died. Gotta be careful of that one. Yeah, and there was like baskets of apples outside a lot of people's houses because people have apple trees and they want people to take the apples as the spare. Oh my god, so cool. Like, there was a one. Ooh, you look cool in black. Oh, balls, I was gonna save a really cool for ability for that. Um. Chrome tape! Chrome tape, Charlotte Quinn! Bonk! Yeah, she dead. I'm quite powerful at this point. M -m -m multi shots! Battering ram! How rude. Still 100. Wonderful. Gwen took a lot of pictures. <sighs> Charlotte Quinn uses oversized sleeves to store items used for public performances, including fireworks, flammable materials, incendiary devices, and more. It's all fire based. Ooh, prismatic. Randomizes the user's type at the end of each round. That's pretty cool. And then it was hours and it died. Galactic beat down. Absurdly powerful move. Love it. Oh. Grounded. Learned by Adolf Sachs. No. Adulf. It's French. Uh. Oh yeah, I'll I'll hang on. I'll show you my various cassette beats. I don't name the regular ones, but I do name the bootlegs. Uh Fancy Trash is a lobster call that's pink and glittery. Faden is the Flapwoods monster, uh, and therefore I've named them after. And they have a tie and they're very bureaucratic, so I named them after director Jesse Faden of the game Control. Uh, HV, Artil HV Ice Tillery. It's an artillerex, so I named it Heavy Ice Tillery. Uh, because it's an ice type. Adolf Sax is the inventor of the saxophone and a variety of other instruments. He also survived several attempts on his life by misfortune and active murder attempts. <laughs> he was a very strange man. Larry, the cable guy. Poding. It's because it looks like it's made out of pudding. It's just cream colored. It's so weird. These spikes. Ah! Is it a ghost? Do I have uh, the ability to fight ghosts? Hang on. Not you. Not you. Phase shift. Oh good, Larry can do it. Okay, brilliant. Hello! Salmagus! I worked so hard to find one of these. They were available in one cave really rarely before. 
so rude that they have one here now. So rude. <sighs> yeah, Sada was always making us tea and checking how we were and just being very nice and very wonderful and... Uh, Despite Sarah being known for being kind of socially awkward, and Gwen also being very known for being socially awkward, at least to me and among uh, new people, uh, they got on like a house on fire. Like, hope I was joking that like all Finnish people appear to be slightly autistic <laughs> or ADHD, and at least among his friend groups, that was completely correct. Uh, everybody was vibing with the awkwardness incredibly well. <laughs> yes, people didn't awkward, they just kind of hyper discussed their hyperfocuses and had a wonderful time and just gelled. It was wonderful. <sighs> I may have eaten a lot of food. And I may feel very full right now. Eh! Mean. I need a second little ride for the other evolution chain. Recording. Yes, there's such an uh, uh, overlap in the diagrams of the Venn diagram of focus. Absolutely. Oh my god, I was talking with P uh, about uh, Laura Kate Dale and Steph Sterling, uh, trans, uh, trans and neurospicy icons. Got a second, little red. <laughs> little, little red. Little red. Little red. Small red. Itty bitty tiny red. Alright, now we just have to finish the battle. Boil. Beast coating. Already beast, but okay. I'm doing for health. Yeah, I could do a bit more health on fancy, fancy trash. You! What are you hiding from me? Fight me! Fight me! Fight me! Fight me! If you're a creature I don't have yet, I want to fight you! Oh, I can do that? Apparently I can. Ugh. Huh. Huh. Come on, come on, fight me, fight me, fight me, come on. I need a gem for its eye. Oh. Horn dead, I have no interest in ye. I've already fought you! Go away! Dejava. I'm poison type. Flam. Oh, God. I got to meet my friend Ailis, who I had not met IRL before, so that was wonderful. I got to... Oh, I got to meet freaking uh, Minamon from the chat. Pictures in the Discord. Super excited. That that was wonderful. Minamon hung out with us, we had food, uh, and they uh, brought us some sweets and presents, which is wonderful. And they drew! They they drew on the little bottom of my taking sheet. Look! Ah! Sold! It's a little goblin! Auction or goblin! Love it! Aware of Elis. Yes, but it was super exciting. Oh, oh mommy. I feel like I'm gonna. Oh. 
I might need to lie down at some point. Wasn't that an angel before? Okay. Weird. <coughs> Interesting even. Oh, a box. Oh, there's many layers to this one. Oh, hello! I believe in ghosts! Fight me! Fight me! Fight me! Is that a bookshelf with a key on it? Come on! Fight me! Fight me! Fight me! Oh. I never want to fight me. Ruby Eye! There we go. Is that a door? Secret door. Can't find my way out of here. Don't need to find this. Don't be looking for me. Try and send help instead. P. I mean, the door's just over there, but whatever. But, if it was in the box. Thought I saw something under the, the slime. Prize ticket. In flame. Pulp. Wheat. Toaster tea. Cool. Oh, hello again. What if they have two forms? I should get another one. Charlie Quinn! Oh. What else? I got to meet Nina Muthik. Uh, Nina is someone that I was wanting to meet, but I wasn't aware- but I- but I had not messaged them before. I didn't. I was aware of their work. I really like their work uh, on the Instagrams, <sighs> being non-binary and poly, and making very funny comics about it, and also very heartwarming ones. Second, Charlotte Quinn. Um. We've gone really well, and I would love to work with them at some point. Really, here's hoping. Wait, does that mean this other bookshelf's gonna have anything on it? No, okay. Cool. So I'll go this way. Yes! Fight me! Oh, it's just Pawn Dead's. I was really hoping there'd be a ghost type that I hadn't, you know, seen before. Suit up. Hey, if you don't, hey, what are you planning? Oh, clearly nothing. You've just swapped them back. Then there was one less. Uh, galactic beatdown cannot be evaded. No, I can't do it just yet. Mm. Trying to a normal smack. <sighs> Unit target is such a. In the butt. Ow. Wait, not that one. Let it be down. It can't be dodged. There we go. That's what I wanted to do. Woo! Bone cannon! They're ready to fall. 
No. Ruby Eye. I, was say, I feel like I fought you all enough. Is there a door here? Secret doors, maybe? Secret doors, maybe? Secret doors? Oh, spooky place. That's just a plate in the air. Oh! You're different. Scarlet Teeth! Ooh, cool. Oh my goodness. Mm. <sighs> so we got introduced to the current chair and the previous chair. Oh, stop hurting yourself. Hey, I'm tired. To the current chair and the previous chair of uh, Lobs Woods. Yeah, don't worry about that, that's not weird. I'm gonna hit multiple targets. Do I have anything that does that? Oh, Torrent does. Torrent! Well, uh... That went a bit... Awesome. Maybe even a bit far. Cold Inflame I can do twice. Zoomies! Why are you dodging everything? Need glad to beat down. Gotcha. Glittery blue, glittery blue. No! Stop it, I have a button I want to push. Okay. Are these holes I can go into? No. Well, technically I can go into them, I just can't get back out of them. No, we're fighting now. Brain's not supposed to eject itself from the nose. I mean, you're right. You're right. But what if? It's been a high achiever. <laughs> oh dear. My word. <laughs> Brain stays on the inside! I see we have evolved from lungs down the inside now. Oh, it's incredible murder. Now you're lightning. I mean, as long as we hit them, they'll die, right? Oh, no. The only organ that's supposed to be... <laughs> the only organ that's supposed to be on the outside is your skin! And sometimes my tongue. Do I get anything cool out of going down these holes? No, but I will investigate them all. Somewhere an enemy got me. Oh, God. 
Hmm. Honestly, I got to meet a whole bunch of new people who I'd not been familiar with the work of, and they were just fantastic. Um, I I talked about Instagram already, but yeah, I got to meet Siri, who mm -hmm. has a wonderful, gorgeous hardback book already out, uh, which I could not resist picking up. Para, who is an amazing gothic uh, artist and fashion. Fashion! Blame. Yese, who does animation and has talked about, we talked about their Blorbos, they're wonderful, like, these are my go-to things that I get to draw and enjoy and have fun. And it's like this pink rooster, tree bark tape, ooh, nice. It's pink rooster and worm cats, cats that are long like worms. It was very fun. No, wait a minute. All the spikes have gone. Ooh, it's a maze! Library key. Use to access the library in the witch house. Cool. Yeah, I could see through this a little because I was like, you want me to use every single square on this floor, don't you? And I was right. Oh. This is great for a couple stinkers. Zoomies! Oh, my goodness. Oh. Ah, no, as well. I, I met a lot of people, so... Good lord, I'm very out of it. The Friday. The Friday. Of the festival. Uh, the day after we arrived. So we had a good sleep and all that. The Friday was a uh, workshop. No, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, I'm just wasting time. The Friday was a workshop on on pitching for comics, uh, printing, publishing, and anthologies. And I had more knowledge than I thought about this, which is really cool. Um, so I got to chat to some lovely people about that. Folks showed off their awesome comics and stuff like that. I keep hitting the wrong buttons. I'm very tired. Uh, I forgot got to show off their existing work, which was super cool. Oh my god, I'm so tired. Oh my god, what is happening to my brain? That's from a lot of people, including Arvi. I didn't know uh, Arvi uh, beforehand. Uh, and it was really lovely getting to to meet them, uh, to meet him. I didn't know that Arvi was married to Sophie LaBelle. <laughs> so afterwards, I ended up having dinner, sat across from Sophie LaBelle, one of the more famous trans comic artists in the world. How many languages does she speak as well? Like, she's French-Canadian. Uh, ooh, poding levels up. Sophie we know, yeah. Yeah, I didn't know that Sophie lived in freaking Finland now. I didn't know that. And yeah, we got to hang out. It was so cool. Oh my god. Amazing. Uh, party. Party, party. Oh, uh, uh, oh. Party, 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 party. Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh. Uh. So Poding still has to level up. 
Yeah, I definitely didn't know that. Oh, maybe it was a secret and I've done something horrible. Let's hope not. Put these two in storage, now I get out of storage. Oh yeah, there's also this south plot I need to name at some point. Would Dana Simpson count as pretty well known too? Phoebe and her unicorn? The name rings a bell. I would say yes, but also I'm bad at name. Not Finn, not smut, trans, yes. Is that the new no fats, no femmes, no Asian? It's like, we've improved it, now Brian doesn't say that horrible thing. Instead it says, not Finn, not smut, but trans. Where's the... Charlequin! Oh, it's also char, like burned. Add to party. Yes. Alright, I need to come out and do that. I have noticed that in the witch house, I... Oh, no. Woo! It's not escape my notice that within the witch house, I have not found any prize tickets. Hello. She is a trans comica, so tangentially related. No, totally related. That works fine. Recommending trans comic artists to me? I wonder where you got that impression from. Was it literally everything I've ever said? Oh my god, that was amazing. The whole trip was so good. I mean that... <coughs> <coughs> A comfy zone where I'm melting like butter. You? No, lol. <laughs> yeah, I had, to, I had to buy some comics while I was there. I, I got a lot of comics. I'll post it in the Discord later. Unless I've already done it, I don't remember. But I've definitely posted it on the Insta. I'm trying to do better at Insta, as I have left the other social medias. Uh... <sighs> Little Red, call for help. Charlequin in flam. Library key. Secret door behind the bookshelf. We all knew this was coming. Or hoped. Oh, that is a, a door. Ah, the door comes to get you. I see. That is a book that is flying at us. Okay. Hi. Oh, it... It appears to have encountered a problem. Oh. As am I encountering problem, it seems. Oh. Damn. Books are a good source of pulp. One of the crafting materials. Why? Easy! Uh, come on, come on, go around, go around, go around. There we go. Thank crap for vine ball. Prize ticket. Earth wall. Stuff and things. Wait. Alright, so there is these book creatures here, and I do want to fight one. But dodge. Do Jump over. I thought it was jump under. Over and under. Yeah, but they're both jump overs. Cool. Yes, you fight me. Haunt home. Cute. Works. Boil. Well, we got rid of one of them pretty easily. Whew. Oh my goodness. So yeah. We had a nice time in Taroku on the Friday. Then we had the workshop in the evening. So Saturday was the event itself, located at the uh, library, and the library was very good. No, I don't want to flee, I want to record. I'm stupid. We kind of took over the whole building and there was a lot of stuff going on. Nino Mythic's comics were playing on a screen. 
uh, there was a bunch of drawing stuff for children around the theme of drawing viruses, which was really cool. Like, getting to understand the daily life of a bacteria, making it cute. Curious? Really cool. Haunter may appear to be a book possessed by a restless spirits, but its eye is an organic creature that's taken root inside a large tome. It flaps its wings to create powerful wings. Cool. Boil! Double, double, toil and travel. So good. Well, for lunch there we had croissants, but massive croissants that had uh, ham and mozzarella in it, enormous chunks of mozzarella, and it was the weirdest thing. I've never encountered this in England. Low lactose mozzarella. Yeah, they had a, a great variety of food options uh, with gluten and lactose free, either as standard or as an available option, like really widely doable, uh, which is amazing. Gasoline spray gives flammable status. <gasps> that sounds amazing. I need to use that. I ain't gonna burn some people. Yeah, I made it. Green engine key. Ah. Oh. Open the engine room in the witch house. Dreams in the witch house. Wait, right, easy, easy. Let's just let me look. Little ghost. No, it's puppy ghost. Green engine key. Thanks. At least slap me out of the way of this door. Ow. It's really hot in here. I feel like I'm gonna pass out. What in the fuck? I guess this is our um, infernal engine, huh? Oh, it's like a. A blueprint or a Galilean sketch. No, Da Vinci even. That's cool as hell! And it's scaring me! Deja vu! Pearl. Pearl gets two moves. Wow, must be nice. Smack. Twice smack. Oh, I'm not fusion ready. Fuck. Toxic stab. If you use deja vu on a deja vu, you get basically multi strike into the end of the, the fight. Ow, bone cannon. Poison! Guzzle fuel, you douche. Oh, it didn't work, what a shame. Fuse! Ripwoods! It just has a. just this big old billiard ball for a head. That's cute. What can I do twice? Double shooting style. That sounds fun. And if I get a crit, then I will get to recharge all my AP. Oh, you can do Berserker! That must be nice.
Slice. Slice twice. Gear shear. Ow. Ow. Ow! Stop it. No. Double lightning. Self-destruct. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Can't do it again, but one and two. Jesus. Whew! Bone cannon. Zoomies. Multi-shot. Machine curse. Reflects all damage and saves is dealt by moves triggered by other passive moves back to the user. Wow, that's a lot of words. Cass, this attraction is officially stable once more. One machine down, two to go. Rude bug didn't give me silk. Yes, I'm playing Palia. Yay, join the game. Your engine trying to kill us wasn't the part of the deal. You're not telling something. Was that engine an archangel? I don't know what an archangel is. All I know is that something strange happened to the engines here. Now they're like that. I don't want anyone to get hurt. See you back at the pier, Cass. Wen says she doesn't know what happened to those engines, but I still feel like she's leaving out a lot of information. We should head back. What's with these, these little, little sparkles in it? I want one. Doesn't really work that way. Okay. Woo! To the darkness! Okay. Okay, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. I'm done. To the rest point! Alright. How many tickets do I have now? I know I got at least like two. Seven? Oh, okay, I'm doing great. Brilliant. So what I want to do is to make these go over to each other. How do I do that? What do I need? This needs the red ticket. Okay. Hello. Hello. Red attraction pass. Woo! Wait, are we going to be on it? Well, that's one way of getting across. But I went on thing when it fell over. I mean, I got over before, I'm just fine by myself, but I do want one of these. Good, I can use my wings. Yes! This means I could have done it before, thinking about it. That's the fun house. Oh yeah, that's why I need this ramp. Aha! The last prize ticket! That's the ticket. Whoop, okay. Yeah, the mechanics on those ones are a little bit crazy. Uh, they, they tend to get shot off in the distance. Hello? Pink pass! I now have all of the passes. Ah, ha, ha, ha! They told me I would never pass! But who passes now? Me, that's who. Except the passing is a faulty notion. Purple button! <laughs> cool wall art. Oh, this is cool. 
<gasps> what are you? What are you, little spaceship friend? Minor Tom. It's a Minotaur rocket ship, for starters, head of a human and body of a rocket ship, and it's Minor Tom as in Major Tom as in David Bowie. Woo, we got some layers going on here. Boil. Flap! Be gone. Dude. It's very cute. Record time. No. Chrome, please. Thank you. Recording. Wow, that works. Crickle. AP, 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 AP. A beep 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 Sonic boom Sonic boom Minder Toms wants novelty automatons Designed to entertain guests at a theme park with some unremarkable parallel earth. Long outliving their creators, they have since gained a mechanical sentience of sort, and now look to sail the stars like the space rockets they resemble. Ah, oh, it just wants to go to space! Love it. <laughs> Doge, stick a trick. The place is the last move the target used with booby trap. Booby trap damages the user. Wow! That's awesome. There's a door. No! I will fight you, but only on my terms. I want this. Oh god! Oh, the floor is just gone. Don't mess this up for me, Felix. Lunar Key! Ooh, Silver Key with a Moon Motif found in the Cosmic Zone. Cool. And it resets. Does that box have any use? Sorry, I'm just trying to figure everything out. Ooh, down you go! But it doesn't do it a second time. Interesting. So if I put this on here, will it still count down or will it stay on? Oh no, it definitely stopped the countdown. Fire! Oh, we've been Vader! Hey, been a while. Smack! Sing this corrosion to me! Hey now, hey now, now! What a metal corrosion to me! In the temple of love. Shine like thunder 
temple of love, cry like rain. In the temple of love, hear me calling. The temple of love, say my name. Ooh, button. That would need a solar key, wouldn't it? Whoa, oh, easy, easy there. Ah, oh. Ha! Ah, still got her. Still got the good old shield on me, though, don't I? Yum, 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 yum. Words. Check on Gwen. Ah, oh, I'm being messaged by someone that I sat next to at the festival. That's really cool. Uh, feminist comic distribution uh, place, which is awesome. You know. Uh, actually, I should shout them out because they're super cool. What's the name? Feministen Comic Distribution. Femi Comics. There we go. Femi Comics Distribution. Feministen. Okay, so, so Finnish words don't have a Germanic underlying. So it just sounds like gibberish, except for borrowed words like feminine. Definitely, uh, that's a borrowed word because it has uh, an I on the end. Um, feministen, I assume it's feminist. Saja Kuva, um, sequential pictures. Toy, Toy Minta, I'm guessing is distribution. Look, I've had it explained to me before, and Finnish is a complicated language that I do not have some existing ability in. So, you know. Do what I can. I'm interested in learning, but also, but also learning is hard. Ooh, woo, oh, whoa. So sad. Sing this corrosion to me. And now, and now, now, and now, and now, now, hey, hey, now, now, hey, hey, now, hey, now, between this corrosion, hey, now, hey, now, sorry, I'll stop there. That was going in a weird direction, <laughs> combining too much bollocks. Ow. Smash. Don't dream it's over. But with the, uh, with, is it Sisters of Mercy that do, uh, corrosion? Hey now, hey now, now. Don't dream it's over to me. Hey now, hey now, now. Copycat. Probably the last move target used if you have AP. And be random. Use a random move you have enough AP for. I don't like be random. It's very stupid. Button. No. Oh, there. It's a hidden switch. I like they're just hiding things. It's pretty cool too. Hey, hey, Felix, get away! Get away! Get out of it! Let me out of the box, Felix. I'm gonna be my buffin. I got more price ticket. Okay. Why? No, don't fall down. I'm guessing this is the way to the moon. Rocket. That seems pretty moon-like. Hello. They come. They come now. To bring a wall between us, ah ha! Okay, now, hey now, don't let them win. Okay, so welcome to Mashup Mondays. Something so random, it happens on Thursdays. Oh, my word. 
I got so many comics, and I'm just, I just had a, a really wonderful time. And Gwen seemed to too, she's been quite down lately, she's been going through a lot, and... Oh. But yeah, I think we both needed a, a good old break from old Blighty, an escape from Turf Island. There's the moon door! Green button! Ah, I thought that was mismatched. Another ticket. Now, moon door! Oh, oh god, okay. Felix, you, you're causing me some confusion here. But I think we also managed to drop a Charlequin into the abyss, so... Good. Ah, Jesus, fucking... This is very confusing. Four. Yeah, I can't jump off it, because, uh... When you're going up on one of those platforms, your wings automatically pop out, and you just can't really move. Can I just lean for? I can't just lean forward. Okay. Convoluted, but it worked. Well, they're not doing themselves any favors. What? Okay. Oh, God. Fortunately, I've got the Au Revoir power up, which allows you to uh, re attain the height of your jump when you flap your wings a second time. Oh, the Aussie has fallen off. They've fallen off. Solar key! Ferrochrome tape. Oh, you can't catch me. Don't worry about it. I'm just going to fly free because this area is a bit uh, perplexing in its design. Yes, fall! Fall into the abyss! <laughs> Okay, so I need to get a, um, a metal box for this magnet switch, for this magnet button. There's one, okay. Can't use it at the same time as my climb. Oh god, I'm gonna have to jump all the way there. Can I do it to here? Okay, I can. Good. Alright. Eep. 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 No. No. This is a cool design, though. Hey! Nope. Hey! 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 Alright, as long as I can still hold the box afterwards, we have a... We have a thing. Shield bash. Foil. Very, very dead. Just the deadest. The most dead. Yeah! On all the things. What? Because you boop the box. Price ticket. There we go. Don't go booping no boxes, okay? What? What? Flip. 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 Alright, we have the solar key. We're at the beginning, so I'm gonna nip out for a sec. 
and rest so that a I can rest uh, and b so that I can potentially evolve my new little critters. Yee! Exciting. Rest. How? Let's see. Gwen still hasn't got back to me, so that's fine. It means that ooh, more powerful fall. Scarlet teeth. So I don't get a choice. Maybe it's day and night. Professor, to take this form in battle is to lose oneself to pure animal bloodlust. Charlequin. Ooh, a clown's purpose to entertain or to terrify. Let's go with entertain. Ah, Blunderbusk. The Blunderbusk is able to fire projectiles with its hand by pointing their hands like guns. Wow, okay. It has a very accurate aim too, despite the fact it's always rocking back and forth and it also lacks eyes. That's, that's got... You got a lot of stuff going on there, girl. You got a lot of prop. You got a lot of stuff going on. Okay, I'm just gonna say that. I'm just gonna say that. Okay, and I'm gonna store these two. And bring out the other versions. Had to party. So I can look more. Uh. I've already forgot what I was doing. Feel red. Whoop. Whoop. I've already agitated something. Oh, it was the all see it. Well, no, go away, you silly UFO. Fight you, but it must be on my terms. <laughs> uh, you switch to Larry because lightning can tear through the uh, flat woods. There it goes. Back. Oh. Woo. So yes, we had the workshop. Then we did the convention itself, the festival. We were sitting at a table. We had a lovely time. We sold really well, actually. I think part of that is recency bias. Like, we were very new and shiny and full of smut. But we bought from some other folks because there was some wonderful, there was like stickers. Gwen bought so many stickers. Gwen is a sticker fiend. Uh, and stickers are great because they're one of the things that indie artists can really get behind. They're cheaper to make than uh, high quality prints or like, they're cheaper to make than glittery prints or holographic stuff. They're cheaper to make than comics. And you only need one good illustration really to make a print of a sticker of that illustration. Um, so, for an indie event, yeah, there was a lot of stickers, which is awesome. <sighs> Gwen got a bunch, I got a bunch, I also got some comics. I got some comics that were in English, and I got some comics that were either very low word count and in Finnish, or very uh, easy for my phone to read, and therefore I would be able to, you know, have it auto-translated. So lucky! Ha 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 ha! The fools. Oh god. This would be very hard if you don't have all the power-ups. Or all the traversal abilities. As it were. Hey! 
None of that! Ground control to Manaton. Commencing countdown engines on. I can't remember. Mission. And turn your engines on. And may God's love be with you. This is me. This is Major Tom to ground control. I'm, I'm feeling very strange. Red engine key. Ooh, superconductor tape. Ooh, cool. You. This is ground control to Major Tom. You really made the grey head. And the papers wanna know who shirts you wear. Now step into the capsule if you dare. Planet Earth is blue and there's nothing I can do. <laughs> Oh, balls. Total murder. Wow. Yeah, I gave it a barrier. Damn it. You swap. Well, you know what actually... You know what actually puts me in mind of? I am judging you for getting the lower lyrics wrong. Still love you, though. Okay, it's, it's fair. There's a lot of lyrics. There's a lot of repeating in the early bits. Here I am sitting in a tin can Far above the world Here's the thing, I, I know that song not as much as I know the Flight of the Concords uh, Bowie parody song Bowie's in space Bowie's in space Thank you for smacking me again with the door! Bowie's in space! What you doing now there, man? That's pretty freaky, Bowie. Oh, it's a silver one! Raven. Oh, I apologize, it's a dark one. Raven and Pearl. Interesting. Oh, it's an astral type. Okay, that's irritating. But it doesn't have to be an astral type. That's what the song puts me in mind of. Glittery! Ow. Oh. oh no, we're all glittery now. I was- I need to water it. I wanted to water it. I, mean, I guess there's no harm if I hit it with the glitter because it's already glitter. So yeah, we hit it with a little glitter. What you doing now there, man? That's pretty freaky, Bowie. Do you have one really funky sequin space suit, man? Or do you have several different t t t changes? Do the smoke grass out in space, Bowie? Or do the smoke astroturf? Oh yeah, oh yeah, it's such an artificial high. Roll me up the astroturf.
Sorry, I was saying I'm familiar with that song and then I got distracted. You may have noticed today, that is something I do. You may have noticed it several times actually in other places too. Yes! Oh, it's the same guy. Fusion power. Oh, critical on right type advantage, which we now have. Yes. Conductive, fully recharged. Oh, not gear shear again. Two, three. Ow. Oh. Oh, conductive. Not handy in this fight, but cool. Yeah. Vault Fist! Infernal Angel died and then Ritualed. And also self destructed. That's just rude. That's a lot of hits you're getting in there. This is Bowie to Bowie. Do you hear me out there, man? This is Bowie back to Bowie. I hear you loud and clear, man. Oh, yeah, man. Your signal's weak on my radar screen. How far out are your man? I'm pretty far out. That's pretty far out, man. Ooh, ah, ooh. I'm off the tinkle tower. Ooh, ah, ooh. I'm drawn in by its gravitational, gravitational pull. I'm jamming now with the McJagganauts, ooh. And they think it's pretty cool, man. Replaces, uh, oh yeah, booby trap again. Ooh. Never seen you tweet, tweet, shiny. <laughs> Nor have I ever done it myself. Nope, certainly not. Yes. You disabled another one of those devilish machines for me. On behalf of Brightside Pier, you have my most resplendent thanks. Another one down. We still don't know why they seem to go wrong. Where these engines come from? Um, why I built them. They meant to keep the pier running without me, but that hasn't quite worked out according to the plan. Once they're all safely disabled, I can figure out what went wrong with them and make them work properly. Sure of it. Yeah! Okay, bye. Gwen's got some secrets. Uh, they're level four. Almost five, almost able to level them again. Hello, we're here to ask you some questions. Are you okay, Bowie? What was that sound? I don't know, man, I have to turn my ship around. Oh, it's the craziest scene! Yeah, I'm picking it up on my LSD screen. Ooh, a rare Bish Bash Bosh! Critical hit on type advantage, yes. Plus 10% critical chance, yes. Uh, and a chance of wall. And hits all team, that's fucking incredible. I should give that to someone. Ah, oh, oh. Uh, be random, broadcast, be de meh. Great. Oh, wait, I have filters on. I forgot about that. Rare! Oh, I'm so glad they added this. It's a feature where you can filter the stickers you're looking through because there's a bonkers number of stickers. Alright, uh, should I give it to Faden? I feel like I should give it to Faden. Or Larry, the cable guy. Uh, how much does it cost? Three, hits whole team, 60 damage. That's pretty incredible. That's better than multi-shell. 
Yeah, it is. Replace. Great news, Flatwoods. You get to find that out immediately. Bish bash bosh, real good nosh. <laughs> Instant murder. And just some incredible. Oh, and a water wall. Oh my god, oh my god, it's so powerful. Hello, I also want to fight you. Yes, I want to fight now. Start a grade! I did think that one was missing from the space themed area. Bish bash bosh. Oh, you've been in this place before. Bish bash bosh. So, yeah, the, okay, so the, the thing that I'm not sure if you would know, Candice, because uh, I don't know where I've said it, versus like if I said it on Insta, because uh, now not everyone's on that. I'm making a blog post for it for the Dragonhide blog, which is a new thing on the new website. Yeah, I'm trying to do some cool stuff. Um, look at me trying to be cool from a different era's uh, definition of cool. Did the workshop, did a convention, did an interview on the stage at the convention, which was lovely. Hope I interviewed us about publishing and how we got into it. And at some point, I think it was before we left the country, it got brought up that after the, uh, the convention committee found out that I did stand-up drag, uh, they were like, that's cool. Do you think they could do, like, stand-up for us? Would they want to do stand-up at the after party? Would they want to do stand-up? Um... Hope I asked, like, could you do a little stand-up set? And I was like, oh, sure, like, if I'm part of another bill, that makes sense. Like, how long is so long? Expecting five or ten minutes, considering that, you know, ten is very much an open mic slot. Um... Oh, wow. Wow, Rare Boil hits... Burns, hits, burns, extra damage, splash damage, and destroys walls. That's amazing. Holy crap. Is that better than the one that Flapwoods has? Crit on type advantage. Mmm. How does it compare? Uh... Destroys walls is so good, but that's irritating. God damn it. Okay, never mind. Alright, we have leveled up the newbies that I wanted to level, so I can now enhance the clown to another level of clowning. Ah, don't fall down! I'll put Little Red away until I know how to evolve them. Pressed. We bond over shared experiences. Charlequin! Yes. To terrify! Oh god! Fragliacci! But, Doctor, I'm the great clown Fragliacci! Oh my god! That's such a good joke. The Fragliacci's whole body is akin, something akin to a ballistic cannon. Its face is merely a cover to the cannon's barrel, which is able to fire projectiles with terrifying velocity. Wow. That's kind of messed up. Wow. Wow. 
Fuck it, I'm gonna put these two in the party and they're gonna level. That's Ookums Bookums, y'all. Ah, Brightside Pier. I made a promise that I'd look after this place. So I can't leave just yet. I wonder if it's like a little girl's or a little child's like cardboard play village thing. Because when you look at her, she has a Gwen, she has an enormous um safety pin. And some big buttons on this outfit, which makes you think that maybe she's a doll. I know people out live out there on that island you come from. But this place is my home. I can't leave it. Not yet, anyhow. No, I can't. <laughs> I need these people to laugh at my jokes. And they're not even funny. Alright, uh, I need to quickly nip back to town. Whoop! Hey. First off, are there any cool rare stickers going on? No. That's irritating. What about this one? Huh. Custom starter! Rare! What's that about? Chance to automatically use the next move in the list at the start of battle. Chance is reduced in proportion to the move's normal AP cost. Passive plus 3% range defense. That sounds pretty cool. I'll just get two of those. I kind of like things that... I don't know. I, w I would like more from a rare. That seems uncommon to me. But plus normal... Plus just extra range defense is really good, in fairness. Let's see. Bish Bash Bosh. Uh... And based on range attack, if higher. Those are both pretty great. Okay, let's grab some of those. I have upgraded my sticker selection. Uh, I have gained a whole bunch of new uh, cassettes. So if I go over here... What is, what's your rumor? A winged cat girl. I can absolutely believe you saw uh, Koneko at the quarry. Greetings. How many different species have you recorded out there? Goodness gracious. 132?! Thank you for your hard work. It's compensation for your time. Fifteen fused materials. An optical laser tape guaranteeing a successful recording. Holy balls. A ritual candle, which normally costs 50 fused materials. Oh, God. I'm sorry. I need to go to the toilet right now. I will, I will be right back, but I need to go immediately. Oh, the gift of prophecy. I get you. You weren't going for Hades, you were going for um, overly sarcastic productions. I get it now. Oh god. So, some context for this incredible bounty. Um, I just got the reward that I would have gotten for getting all of the creatures in the main game. But there's a lot more ones now. I think I was very close. I think I was like four off. Ms. Mimic was one of them. Uh, but now obviously I've hit a bigger number than 128. Uh, because I was able to get some more stuff from Peer of the Unknown. Uh, like, this is worth 50 fused materials. This is worth 50 fused materials. This is worth 15 because it's 15. And then also some other random stuff. Like, really crazy great number of... Uh, the amount of value. That must be all the known monsters in New World. Well, except for the bootlegs, fusions, and archangels. It's going to take me some time to finish cataloging all the species you've shown me. I'll, when I have a request for you, I'll leave it on the notice board outside. Hmm. Shame. That's the best way to get stuff. All right, I have some more fusions. What can I use it for? Microphone upgrade. Increases chance of successful recording. Camera stream mod, critical mod. So 
So I got all the basics of them, so it means that they would increase at all. I'm doing this. Or I could get some more gym points in order to increase my stats. Of course, now I need to be RB lol timing. Cool. After you get back, I'll probably do a raid. Because, yeah, my stomach is, uh... She's having a moment. She's having a moment. Fusion mod. Make your vision meter feel 15% faster and you can go up and up and up. Jesus, that, does that go all the way to 100% faster? Jesus. Alright, let's just get some of these, these basic mods that will increase the amount of fusion meter gained by reasonable amounts. Chance of successful recording will be increased when your fusion meter is full. That's awesome. That I want some more of. Let's tell Ianthe about. So the Merlin expects us to handle the rogue fusion situation ourselves. Oh, hang on, no, she's like a detective. So, the Merlin expects us to handle the rogue situation fusion situation ourselves, does it? Play it through blinds. At least we have Knightsbridge Station to retreat to if things get bad. Thanks for your hard work. Cass, I said before that if you left New Wirral, I wouldn't hold it against you. And I still stand by that. But if you desire to stick around a bit longer, the work that I have for you is literally never-ending. I'm sure you know the drill by now. Quest complete. Here comes the sun. Save. Oh my goodness, wow. Yawnings. Uh, let's have a look for rumours, see if I know anyone who might be able to give me a hint about Little Red. An unstable fusion's made appearance in Eastern Woods. Big three rogue fusions, and liver and attached parcel. Let's see. Hey, Sunny! I love them. Cosplays them. Oh, question mark. Could you have any information for me about Little Red? <laughs> Strange creature, skittish little goblin fellow. Oh. No, that's fine too. It's not what I'm looking for, but cool. Thanks for the rumor. Cool, whatever. Anyone down here got any rumors? I heard a rumor. Yes, those are the sounds I make when I sneeze. I'm not proud of them, but I won't be ashamed by them. Okay, quest log. Uh, Passes delivery, nice and easy. The mall! Oh god, am I in the fall down mall? Something's gonna come out and try to kill me. Yep, 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 dodge. I'll just deliver this parcel. I'll just do one more side quest. Parcel delivery is an easy duty. Hey, Cleo! No! Give me the parcel! Thanks a bunch, I've been waiting for this. Teeny a bit of experience points. Ooh, dude, I've been waiting for this. I've been waiting for this. Oh, I didn't quite mean to get here. Oh well. Let's 
Same. Right, let's have a see. Well, oh, yeah, my gut's having a moment. Let's see who is available for a riot. <sighs> Deep Blue Ink. Jawstone. What is Deep What is Jawstone doing? How long have they been doing it for? Raid! Session 1 slash 4. Will they allow me to? Unable to raid at this time. Yeah, cool. Thanks. Deep Blue Ink. Oh, Deep Blue Ink is playing Gardic Phone. That's always delightful. Let's get ready to raid ball. Thank you everyone for hanging out with me as I play this spoopy DLC. Here the unknown. Sorry. I'm still recovering from getting back from Finland, as you can see. Oh, plus my bowels decided to mess me up at one point there. So that's fun. I still love Cassette Beasts. I'm very excited to be able to play it more. I also know from talking to Gwen that A, the Switch version has been patched and runs a lot better now. And B, that the, um... There are some new uh, fusions available. There is No, there are some new evolutions available for existing uh, critters. Yes, they've added some. Yes, like, Furious, I don't have. Actually, I think that wasn't new. I think I just didn't have it. Anathema. Yeah, so I had, a, I had two more to get in here, and I still don't know what they are. But yeah, there's more stuff. Uh, anyway, it's raid time. Say hi to Deep Blue Ink. Uh, Tiny Raid. Yeah, I will, I will happily just use those ones as well. Hope you all have a wonderful day. Goodbye, trans rights.